Would you like to see how our five-day-old chickens are doing? I'll bring a few out so you can see them better. I've got paper down on my workbench so if the chickens make a mess it's easy to clean up. And I've also brought out this little space heater just to keep them a little bit a little bit more comfortable. All five are doing just fine, but I'm just going to bring the three out for now because it's easier for me to keep them corralled. Come back here. <laughs> yeah. They're definitely fluffier than they were just a few days ago. It's okay, little chickens. Kind of see the little feathers are starting to come in. You can definitely hear these guys cheeping from inside the house. Back here. Oh, come back here. They're getting a little more curious about the world. At just about 24 hours after these chickens hatched, I set up this brooder in my shop. We're gonna go ahead and move these five chickens out to the brooder. Even though we built the uh, quail hutch to be a brooder as well as a quail hutch, it's a little cold this time of year for baby chickens. So we're gonna keep them in the garage in a, I guess more of a traditional brooder in a plastic tub with a heat lamp. And we've also got a little heat plate chick warmer in there as well. I've got a little box and a lot of chickens so they're going to be a little cozy on the transport. Oh. 
I think they're okay in there, but we'll give them a little more room in the actual brooder. We've got the brooder covered in a blanket just to help keep the temperature up a little bit. Here's your water. Now, go right on here, I'll keep play. Yep, good. Water, good for you. And Wendy was adamant about not letting the chickens live inside the house. So, here in the shop they're going to be until they're big enough to go outside. here the chickens in our main flock just aren't laying eggs like they used to this is the time of year when the days are just about as short as they're going to get and chickens just don't lay as many eggs this time of year it's a little frustrating I've had to disappoint a lot of our longtime egg customers well I'm gonna try and do something about that because happy chickens just might lay more eggs for us. We've got a flock block for them as a treat. Wait for me to get the plastic off, chickens. <laughs> Come on, you be a good chicken. I'll have to tell you in a couple of days whether our egg count goes up or not. Okay, chickens, have at it.
All right. It's time for you little peepers to go back.